Hello, everybody. Today's topic is going to be application monitoring in FortiMonitor. So to look at application monitoring, we start in the menu on the left. We click on monitoring and then applications. And that'll give us a list of all the different applications that we're monitoring. And you can see that for each of these applications, we're monitoring it from multiple different vantage points. We're doing it from endpoints. We're using our on-site collectors. We're using our public probes. And we can even drive traffic across SD-WAN devices. By clicking on the details for one of our applications, I can see along the top the performance over the last day, the last week, the last month from all of our uh, different vantage points. And then if I mouse over the items on the map, I can see how the individual locations are performing. When we take a look at the individual checks, I can go and take a look at things like HTTPS, we're doing network quality checking. Uh, so we're doing packet loss, jitter, latency against uh, from each of the vantage points to our target application. We're also doing path monitoring. In this case, we're doing a trace route and ping every, in this case, every 10 minutes. So we get some information about the path that all of our endpoints are taking to get to the target. In this case, our target is teams.microsoft.com. And then we can see uh, how each of our locations, the path that it's taking, we can see uh, each node that it's hitting. And then it, we can see in between the packet loss and latency between any two individual hops. If we take a look down into the checks, you can see that our for HTTPS GET, we've got an alert set. So if the application returns an error or it takes too long, we can set an alert and be notified when there's any kind of an issue. Looking at the locations, you can see our vantage points. We've got our public locations. We've got some on-site collectors. We've got some endpoints. And if I drill into uh, this endpoint, this will give us some detail about uh, the Wi-Fi performance of this machine. This is my Wi-Fi machine that I have running. So on this machine, we're collecting every minute metrics about CPU, memory, disk, uh, network utilization. Uh, in this case, I want to focus on some of the digital experience metrics that we're collecting. So in this case, we've got the, uh, our device metrics, so uh, we can see the Wi-Fi signal strength, we can see the download speed. This is just an hour's worth of data, so let's go back a week so we have something to look at. So here's my Wi-Fi signal strength over time. You can see that it floats between about 85 and 90, uh, and that's normal for this machine. And then the download experience, this is a speed test that runs every hour and uh, gives us a, some detail about the download speed on this particular device. If we want to look at you know, some of the network quality metrics, I'm just going to jump over to uh, one of our other endpoints here. Uh, this is, um, in this case, a, a wired laptop. There's a couple of things I want to show you here. So we are collecting you know, all the metrics here for uh, CPU, memory, disk utilization. But also, if we focus on network quality, uh, you can see our uh, network quality, our latency, jitter, and packet loss over time. This is the last hour. We can see the last week. As with all FortiMonitor metrics, we can go back uh, a year by default and two years with the, uh, uh, the extended uh, data retention. Looking at the outbound synthetics here, so this machine is being used as a test location for a number of these different applications. So you can see here that we're uh, collecting um, you know, metrics. So if we look at our HTTPS metrics, I'll expand this chart and uh, show a little bit more detail. So again, this is a, you know, a, a user's uh, laptop, and it's being used to test the availability of a number of different URLs over time. Uh, this is the last hour. And again, if we go back a week, a month, or a year, uh, we can see uh, extended performance for each of these different uh, applications. So application monitoring in FortiMonitor, it is just one of the use cases that we have with our DEM monitoring, there are many other use cases like uh, DNS checking, certificate expiration checking, and we can even do scripted transactions. Those topics will be covered in other videos. Uh, so thanks for watching, and we will see you on the next one.